welcome to the vlog. Oh, gosh, I'm shaking. It's like really cold out here. So, it is Monday. It is my off week. You guys have asked me what I do on my off week. So, I normally just tell you I make YouTube videos, which is not a lie. You're going to see some of that. But I wanted to show you some of the other things I do, so I thought I would show you a couple days. So, today is my first day off this week. I got off this morning around 8.30. Went home, ate some breakfast or dinner, whatever. I, it was a piece of toast, okay? Not a whole lot. Then I tried to get some sleep, so I slept for like around four, four and a half hours. And then you just saw me going to physical therapy so now i have an order pick up at target so i'm gonna go to target i'm also gonna drink some coffee even though it's like 5 30 because my husband doesn't get off till 11 tonight and i would like to see him part of the problem with my night shift schedule is like right now i don't see my husband some days and so i didn't see him for like two days and i saw him for like an hour hour and a half that i could keep my eyes open this morning but i would like to see him tonight so i'm gonna drink some coffee to try to stay awake and hopefully like target will keep me awake there's a lot of things there, so let's go. Target was a success. I really didn't need anything other than coffee and to do the order pickup. It was for my husband's Christmas gift. I can't tell you what it is because he may watch this. He doesn't watch all of my videos, but he watches quite a few of them. And if he hears his Christmas gift is on here, he may actually watch this. So I'm not gonna tell you what it is yet, but I'm hungry since my husband does not get off for another like five hours. I think I'm just gonna order some sushi real quick. Columbia, how can I help you? Hi, I need to place a to-go order, please. Hello, yeah, would you like to order today? Can I get just one tiger roll, please? Sure, anything else? That'll be it. All right, that should be ready in about 15 minutes. Okay, sounds great, thanks. Okay, so while my sushi is getting done, let's go to Marshall's, cause I'm cold and I need a new jacket. <laughs> you guys what I got at Target and Marshalls. I didn't get a whole lot from Target. I got some elf wrapping paper. I got some sloth wrapping paper and frozen for my little cousins. But I'm really excited about the stuff I got at Marshalls. So I told you guys I was cold and I needed a coat, which was not a lie. Like the coat I have is like very big and bulky. It's a spider ski coat. It's very warm, but I need something for like that in-between time when it's not like cold enough that I need one. So I got this Michael Kors one. I just really liked it. I liked the buttons on it and the quilting pattern. And it's like, I don't know if you can really tell. It's not very thick. So it's kind of like a nice cute coat, but not a very warm coat if that makes sense. And up until this point, I like looked in my closet and realized that like, I don't have anything that's warm. So I bought a sweater. This is so, so, so soft. And it looks really warm and it was like $17. So go Marshalls. Does anybody else go to Marshalls and always leave with leggings? Because I have a problem where I go to Marshalls and I buy a new pair of leggings. But this time I had a reason because I bought these spider leggings. I love spider brand if you haven't noticed, but I have the jacket that matches this color exactly, which is why I had to buy the leggings because I already had the jacket. And my favorite part is it has a little pouch in the back. So cool. So I also had not jumped on the shacket trend. It's just not for me. But then I found this one and it's the light pink that is the entire color of my brand. And then gray, which is also a color. So I, I, I caved. I got this jacket because it's really soft and nice. And I figured I probably actually would wear this one. And lastly, I bought some new gray boots because it's boot season and I have like one pair of booties. So now I have two. Okay, so I have several things to do. Number one, I need to edit. I don't need to finish the video today, but I feel like I need to get started. So I'm probably gonna do that for like an hour. And then I need to do laundry and clean my house because tomorrow I'm getting headshots done and some of the things that I want to wear are not clean. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. So 
I started looking at the video I was supposed to edit today and I'm gonna have to scrap it all because the entire middle portion didn't record. And I can see that it was supposed to be there because it like just cuts off and then picks up midpoint and another clip. So I don't know what happened to that middle clip, but that's like the meat of that video. I'm upset, <laughs> but I'm doing a Q&A, like a live Q&A on that topic. So it's not like you guys aren't gonna get that information from me somehow. It just really sucks that the video I had recorded is not there. Good news is I have other videos recorded that I can post for you guys. So I guess I'm gonna work on one of those instead. editing done and I have laundry going in the background. My husband's going to be home soon so I'm going to cut off this part of the vlog here and I will see you tomorrow. We're going to go get our nails done. We're going to get pictures done. We're going to do some filming. It's going to be a busy day so see you tomorrow. Good morning guys. So I just went and got my nails done. They look so cute. I love this color pink. I wanted something that's like, obviously I got my nails done, but very subtle. So now I need to grab some food. It's like 1045. I have to be there at one, but my drive is about an hour. So I'm gonna grab something to eat and then we'll head to the photography studio. Inside the studio for my photos and as you can tell I don't have my hair and makeup done because they're actually gonna do it for me right before I do the photos like the first hour is hair and makeup the second hour is actually the photos so I have like three outfits in the back that I'm gonna like go through and Crystal already agreed to let me film this so you guys are gonna get to see a little bit behind the scenes of the photo shoot So the pictures turned out so, so good. I am really excited about them. I think you guys are gonna really like them. I'll show like the finalized ones up here on the screen right now. I just wanted some professional photos. You guys asked me for like headshots when I do student speaking events and things like that. So I wanted something to give you that was a little bit better than the picture my husband took back in my second year of pharmacy school. It was time for an update. I'm just so happy how they turned out and I can't wait to see the final product. So I'm gonna run not run, drive home, and then do some filming because I have my hair and makeup all done, so I might as well do it. Okay, confession time. Night shift got to me really bad this week, and by the time I got home, I was so exhausted, I just took a nap. So I didn't do any filming, so you guys aren't gonna see that in this video, but I really do appreciate you guys following along with me. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.